During one of my lives, someone said they were interested in the gear that I take around with me when I travel, and I thought, okay, why not? First thing is a tripod that's compatible with both my camera and my phone. A couple of backup batteries, which I haven't had to use lately, but it's better to be safe than sorry. A 15 inch MacBook Pro is a lot to carry on your back for extended periods of time, so I keep it in a soft case in my carry-on. This is my newest addition, it's a Rode Travel Mic. I'm using it right now and I think it works really well for what I need out of a microphone. I used to carry the big version of this mic on me, but it came in three pieces and was actually really hard to fit into the suitcase. The big microphone was also the reason why I got searched a couple of times after my case has been x-rayed, so I think that TSA, when they see it, suspect that it's something that is not a microphone. Now this soft case holds all my camera equipment. Aftermarket zoom lens, camera body, spare battery and a charger, and a shotgun mic. One or two RGB lighting panels depending on how I feel when I pack. And my old iPhone 11 Pro, which I keep on me as an emergency backup but use every time as a security camera at least. These guys don't sponsor me or anything, I just use them so I'm just letting you know about it. It's called Alfred Camera and it's like a Wi-Fi security system that uses your phones. If it senses movement, it'll send me an alert and it will start recording. It also sends the video to my phone so I could show it to my insurance company if something happens to my stuff. I keep this more for Airbnbs than I do for hotels. It's just that with Airbnbs, you don't know who or how many people have had access to the place that you're staying in. People might have copies of keys or still have the codes to your room. Who knows? In my backpack, I keep my cable management, a travel wallet, some face masks, and an iPad with a keyboard on it because it's a lot easier to use in cramped spaces like an airplane. I use my iPad more for when I'm working on my book. It's just way easier to bring around when all you need to do is write. Not to mention the fact that I'm signing more documents than I ever thought I would in life, so it's really great for that too. And finally, when I'm not using it for either of those things, it's also a camera in my to-go security system. Sorry about the vertical long-form video, I expected this to be a short, but it turns out I had a lot more to say about my stuff than I initially thought. I also have a travel kit for all my knives and cooks tools. If you're interested in learning about that, let me know.